Okay, how to trademark a name? In this video, I'm going to talk about that. If you're new to this channel, seriously, subscribe. Subscribe, just press the subscribe button. And if you uh, like this video, like it, seriously, like it. So we're going to talk about the trademark, how you can trademark the name. Important part is of trademark is you need to know how to find the trademark rules. So I cannot tell you exactly what you need to do, but technically you need to look it for yourself. If you look it for yourself and you know how it works, it's going to be much easier. So when you want to register a trademark, it's important to know what are the regulations in my country or where I am active. Let's say if I'm living in Europe and I'm active in, let's say, in America, I need to know the rules about in America. It's that simple. So your biggest question is, how do I find the rules? That's why I'm going to talk about that. When you know about where you can find the rules, you will see automatically on the website how you can trademark. A lot of people will write a lot of general article. doesn't help you. Seriously, it doesn't help you. If you have a problem with choosing the country where you are active, feel free to join the Discord, go to Texas channel, and then we can help you or not. We will tell you if we can help you or not. So our main goal is to find the rules. How can we find the rules? right so it's it's not that difficult what you can do is you can just go to wipo.int um, yeah international means that if i'm correct so you go here wipo you look for member states look if your country is here if your country is here that's good let's say if i'm from belgium i'm not but if i'm from belgium i press here it will bring me to the website here. I can get the general idea, general information about the intellectual property of the country. But does this help you? Nope. Seriously, it doesn't help you. Yes, you can find some information about the country, so about the IP law, what they do, but it doesn't help you. Seriously, it doesn't help you. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to Google. If you go to Google and you type exactly this, or not that, um, directory of intellectual property office so you press that you will get to this the problem is on this website this website is most of the time broken but it still works okay? and now it's broken while I'm recording sorry about that okay? but it's hard to find this directory on the website I can show you but I'm not going to waste your time so you go here and this is what you need why is this important here you'll find exactly in which country, what, what AP, um, IP office you have. Let's say if I'm from Albania, copyright office, I can see it here and I can go exactly to the website. And this is something you need. Why is this important? And why did I choose Belgium at the beginning? So if we look at Belgium, where are you, Belgium? You see here you have Belgium, intellectual property office, and you see here the website. And this is technically what you need. If you go for the Netherlands, you will see they have co a colony. See the Netherlands, and you see you have a lot of co copyright office. You see here, colony, copyright office, St. Martin copyright office, and the others one. So here you will find the general information. Why do I say this? Because some country, they have special rules. And you need to know exactly what are the copyright office. And on the website of the copyright office, you will find the rules in your own country um, in your own language so that's about it for this video how you can register a trademark if you have question about it what you can do is just go in the discord go to the channel text us and send me a message i will try to help you as soon as possible if you're new to the channel seriously subscribe subscribe i'm waiting i hope you guys like this video and i will see you in the next one bye